What's happening? It's Kadeem Hardison, and I'm here at Shadow and Act. Will you? Pass it on those who ask the questions, Bubba. Oh. I love you, and if you'll have me, I want you to be my wife. What the hell are you doing? Hey, I'm sorry, Byron. I love her. Duh, just die. Just die. Will you have me, Dwayne, as your lawfully wedded husband from this day forth? To have, have it all. To hold. And richer, and poorer, richer for poorer. Baby, please, 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 as a man, I didn't buy it. What I pitched to the writers was, let me go the night before to her, before the wedding, like without this big pomp and circumstance and all these people around, let me just go right to her and have a sit down with her and say, is this real, are you going to do this? We can hop this fence and be out and, and go off and live our life. And then they wrote it for me, and they, kind of, and, they, and they put it in the script. Like, I really was agonizing all week. It was no good. It was like, really, Debbie, really? Yes, honey, yes, we're doing it. Like, so when I got to uh, the vows, will you, to have and to hold, all of that, I was a little nervous because <laughs> the lines left me. Baby Please was just like a cry for help, like one actor to another, like, yo, I messed up. Help! <laughs> Help! Girl, say your line, or we gonna have to do this again and again and again, and I know it's just gonna get, it's gonna degrade each time. So if we can get it, and Debbie said, got it, moving on, and I was like, yeah! One take. So you're the husband I've heard so much about. And you're the sister I've heard nothing good about. <laughs> you look Familiar. I had a 50th birthday party, um, and she came, she came and surprised me. Everybody, it was a surprise. Everybody was there, and the boss, Rob Lauderstein of Casey Undercover, he was there, and he just watched us and said, hey, would you, would you think about getting you guys together on the show? What do you think about that idea of inviting her to come down? And I just thought, oh my God, that would be so good. Not even thinking about, not even thinking about the different world crowd and, and, and that, I just love working with her because she's so good. So I knew that, you know, even though I don't have many scenes with, I didn't have many scenes, we did get to fight in this joint, which was fantastic. Oh, oh God. Black shit with me, all right? <laughs> if you're hungry, I'll run you down to KFC down the street and hit you off with a two-piece. <laughs> I already had Italian. <laughs> <laughs> Eddie doesn't stick to any script. And, and when he doesn't, then you get the freedom not to. I had so much fun doing this. More fun, I think, than I mean, I'm gonna get you suckers close. Cause that was early on. And that was, Damon was my, my comedy guru. But Ed was, you know, he was some kind of, you know, some kind of Jesus, he was a God. And for him to kind of call me on the phone and say, I've seen all the tapes, you're the only one in town that can do it. You gotta come do this part. And that was like, oh shit, okay. That's my favorite. Thank you for that. I don't. I don't watch me. I have a hard time watching me. But this was a. Uh, this was fun. <laughs>